I'm going to play a game of solitaire for American Mahjong using National Mahjong League rules. If you are new to this game, there's a link in the video description below to a lesson playlist. In this game of solitaire, we're going to keep things spicy by adding a house rule. If you're new to Mahjong, or if you already know how to play and just want to build your skills, consider subscribing to my channel. That way you won't miss anything. All my tiles have been mixed and built into walls next to the risers. This way we can keep track of the progress of the game based on how many tiles are left for picking. I'm going to deal the tiles now. Player one will get 14 tiles. Players 2, 3, and 4 will get 13 each. Then we'll look at each player's hand and see where the strengths lie. We'll be able to pick out a category to play, and in some cases, maybe even a hand. We're going to roll the Anarchy die. The result will tell us which house rule to play. Dora. We're going to play Dora. I will explain. We're going to flip the last tile in the wall to reveal the Dora indicator. Six BAM. Six BAM is the Dora indicator. So the next tile up in order is Dora. Seven BAM. Everybody has their tiles. Let's look and see what we can do for player one, also known as East. We have, we have an East and a South, five, seven, eight. This is Dora. If we build around that, we could increase the value of our hand exponentially. Here we have two eight in dots, a pung of two cracks. That's not helpful with Dora. Then here we have six, seven pair of nines. Let's test Dora for American Mahjong and focus on six, seven, eight, nine to increase the value of our hand. Six, seven, eight, nine. We can use seven and nine. Or maybe we could play five, seven, seven, nine. Odds. Five, seven, seven, nine. Let's pass those three and focus on either consecutive using seven because it's Dora or five, seven, nine because of Dora. Let's see what we can do for player two, also known as South. We have a flower, two, seven, eight, one, five, nine, one, two, three, four. Pair of fives, pair of nines, five, nine. I think we should play big odds. Big odds or something consecutive. Most likely in one suit, so probably big odds will be best. Let's keep odds. We'll keep odds. So let's pass those three. Actually, let's swap this out. That way we have a good set of tiles for the next pass. Let's see what we can do for player three, also known as West. Flower no, uh, North, one five and crack, six, seven, nine. Then we have a lot of bams with a pair of sixes and Dora. I would work in Dora. Five, six, seven, eight. 
consecutive run. Four, five, six, seven could work. Maybe we could play a pair hand. Six, seven, eight, nine, six, seven, six, seven. Let's give up the five crack. Let's see what we can do for player four, also known as North. West, Dragons, how can I forget the Joker? One, two in Bams, one, five, eight, nine, pair of fives in Cracks, and then a single nine dot. I think I would try for something with the fives. But there is year hand potential here. One tile to pass. We could give up the West. So we have year tiles and we have a pair of fives. The five, seven, nine hand uses an opposite dragon. Five, seven, seven, nine dragon. Five, seven, seven, nine dragon. Cracks, dots, bams. We have all the dragons. We do have ones. We could play like numbers with ones. Let's give up the nine and see what comes in. So consecutive run, big odds, consecutive run, like numbers with ones maybe, or like numbers with fives if we happen to get fives. I'd like to leverage these dragons. Here we have Dora, here we have Dora. Every instance will multiply the value of your hand. We're ready for the Charleston. First right, east passes to south, south to west, west to north, north to east. We were looking for consecutive. We got a nine and an eight. We have all those twos. We want to work in Dora. Let's give up a five. Seven, eight, seven, eight, eight, nine. Let's see, seven, eight. We want to use the seven if we can. I wouldn't pick a hand till we run out of discards for any of these. Here we're trying for big odds or odds. We could maybe do the concealed hand and that even uses the seven bam, which is Dora. We did pick up a multiple here, but I want to focus on odds. Let's pass those. We were looking for consecutive three, four, five, six, seven. We want to try to use Dora. We did get an eight, six, seven, eight, nine potential, six, seven, six, seven. Consecutive run, second from the bottom under consecutive run. These are all year tiles. That would be a really, really terrible pass. We did get a one for that one through seven pair hand. Let's give up the eight. Six, seven, six, seven. One, three, five, seven. We have a multiple here though. Four, five, six, seven, five, six, seven. Year tile. Let's break this up. There's risk either way. Let's keep the nine and pass two, three, eight one of each suit, and we'll probably have to give this up later and give up on the pair hand. We got a five and a north. I wonder if we could force a quint. We did pick up a one though. 
like numbers with ones. Like numbers with ones. This, this would be risky to hold if we don't use it at this stage of the Charleston. I think what I would rather do here is leverage the Pung and give up on the pair. Let's keep the North. Maybe we can force a Quint or like numbers with fives. This is going to be a really risky pass, year tiles. No matter how you slice this, it's going to be risky. But we could be playing a big hand, so let's do it. We're going across. We got an eight. Seven, eight, eight, nine, six, seven, eight, nine, six, seven, eight, with sevens concealed. Six or seven, eight, nine with eights. We'd have to throw away Dora. There's two tiles to pass. We have to whittle this down. We have seven, eight, eight, nine, nine, seven, eight, nine, seven, eight, nine, mix suit, Kongs. We have no flowers and no other multiples. We do have this multiple though, eight, nine. We want to try to use this tile. Six crack. Let's hold these and give up a six crack. Let's see if we can work that in. We got a nine. Five, seven, seven, nine, five, nine. That's not a seven, that's a nine. Five, nine. We can pass those three. It's a little risky. Okay, we got a five. Five, six, seven. We can pass those. Risky here. Year tiles. We have a south. North and south with fives. Winds and dragons. Hand number four. We don't have any flowers though, so that's a gap. We have tiles we can pass, year tiles, look at that. But they're going around, I would risk it. We went to cross, now we're gonna do first left. East passes to north. North to west, west to south, south to east. No keepers there. We did get an odd. The twos keep going around. I think I would break it up and hold odds. Little odds in one suit for the concealed hand as an option. No keepers here. We picked up a six, five, six dragon. There's tiles to pass. This is a little risky because it's consecutive, but at least it's one of each suit. All of these have risk. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, three. Looks like everybody's in big numbers and that's actually what's happening. Here we do have a couple of little numbers. This is gonna be interesting. We'll see how it works out. We're going to do second left. Everybody has tiles to pass. No keepers. 
no keepers. We have a three again. Kyle's to pass. Five, six, five, six, seven. That's Dora. Three through seven. Five, six, seven, eight. That's really risky too. Look at that. Oh my goodness. Six, seven, six, seven. I think I would give up the three. Let's pass those three. We got an east. I don't think that's going to help though with this. At least north and south we can use with odds. And five, six dragon is a potential if we can get flowers. So now we're going to go across. We got a nine, seven, eight, nine, mixed suit Kongs, third hand down, seven, eight, nine. We could pass one of each suit. We got a one, two east. The one came back. Well, let's keep the one and give up. Oh, no, 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 no. Like numbers is like passing a pair. I try not to do that. Very rarely will I do it. So we didn't get any keepers here. We are on last right. East to south. South to west. West to north, north to east. No keepers. No keepers. I would hold this. Maybe somebody will change their hand. We did get a two. I would probably discard all the, oh, we still need to do we still need to do optional cross. How could I forget optional cross? That's okay. No keepers here. Unless we, uh, we have no flowers. I was thinking maybe we could play addition, but we have no flowers. And we have a one and a six crack. This would need to be a six dot. I think I would still focus on like numbers with dragons or north and south with fives. So we are on optional cross. No keepers. We've got joker bait. But the twos kept going around, so that's probably not going to be good. If you want to know more about joker bait, there are videos that I've made that demonstrate how it works. Just look in the video description below for links. Basically, you hold a pair that you don't need, and around the middle game, you discard one. Someone makes an exposure with a joker, and on your next turn, you use the second one to make an exchange. That's how it works in a nutshell, or supposed to work. We got a one, one through seven. Wonder where the three is. We can pass that. Oh, we're done. Those are discards. We got a one. Maybe we can play addition if we get flowers. Five, six, eleven. Discards. So we're done with the Charleston. We're going to start by discarding for East. We'll start with East. We're going to use this to mark whose turn it is. Isn't that pretty, Joker? Mahjongdice.com. There we go. We're going to draw. We got a five dot. One, three, five, five, seven, nine. We need that seven bam. This would be the last hand under cons uh, odds. Let's discard West.
west. Eight dot. We don't need a two. Let's discard your tiles. Nobody wanted them anyway. We'll draw. Three bam. We want seven, eight, nine here. Let's get rid of the two dot. Four bam. Let's get rid of one bam. South. It's not a keeper for them. Four bam. Three, four, five, six consecutive. Let's discard eight dot. Nobody can take it. We got a six crack. Six, seven, eight with sevens, maybe. Let's discard two crack. Nobody wanted it, so this is probably not gonna be good. Joker bait. Three dot, we'll keep it. Who knows if we'll be able to use that. Because we have a five nine, we only need a single here for this concealed hand. Nobody wanted the two, so let's throw that. Six bam. We'll hold that. Let's see. Five, six, seven consecutive Kongs, maybe. Let's throw two crack. Seven bam. That's unexpected. We'll keep it because it is Dora. Let's discard four bam. One bam. Six dot. Hmm. Looks like we have some consecutive in here. Four, five, six. A little bit. I don't think it's going to work though. Well, let's discard two crack. Nobody wanted it. We'll probably need to discard that. Green dragon. Maybe we could play six, seven dragon. Let's discard four dot. Joker. That could come in handy. Let's discard three bam. We're going to have to make a decision about Dora in a minute. Seven crack. Seven, eight, nine. Seven, eight, nine. Let's discard one crack. I'm thinking seven, eight. Let's see. Seven, eight, nine with eights concealed. No Dora. We'll see. They have a discard, so we still don't have to pick a hand. Ooh, Joker. Well, we might be able to play that concealed hand. I think that can go. I think we should keep with odds. Let's throw four bam. Two dot, whoops. East, that's out. South. Oh, Joker. Let's discard six dot. We still really don't have to pick a hand, but I think 
This concealed hand looks pretty good. We really need a seven bam in there. But if we can get these, we could be ready to win and call it for Mahjong. Or we could play five, seven, nine and use these for the sevens. All right, well, we'll see what happens there. These are all keepers right now. Six crack. Five, six, seven. We have sixes. I think we can get rid of that and focus on bands. Let's throw six crack. Up here, we could Kong. We have no flowers. That's a big gap. I don't think we're going to be able to use Dora. We could maybe play Kongs with dragons and flowers, but we have no flowers. Even though we can use jokers, I think we are at a place where we have to make a choice. We kind of have to make a choice here. Like numbers with fives is still a potential. We wouldn't need all these dragons though. Six crack. We would have to use our only jokers there. With a gap and no flowers, I would not commit. We're going to let it go. We got a one dot, so we'll discard the last tile in the second wall. Everybody should know what category they're in. Here we're playing consecutive run, odds, consecutive run, like numbers with fives, if we can get other fives, <laughs> or maybe addition or consecutive run five, six dragon with flowers, and we have a gap. We got a seven dot. Seven, eight, seven, eight, seven, eight. Let's just card three, bam. We're going to have to make some choices here. Maybe six, seven, eight with sevens. That would use Dora. Four dot. One, three, five, five, seven, nine. Five, seven, nine, three, four, one, three, three, four. There are three two dots out, so I don't think I would be switching to consecutive run. Let's discard four dot. Stick with odds. West. One bam. Nine dot. This is getting kind of crazy here. Nine dot. Six, seven, eight, nine. Seven, eight, nine with eights. Six, seven, eight with nines. We have no nine bam. I don't know if that's going to be helpful. Six, seven, eight, nine. I'm thinking seven, eight, nine with eights concealed. Seven, eight, nine with eights concealed. If we get flowers, we could do seven, eight, seven, eight with flowers. Four, four, four. We have to discard. I think those nines are not going to be helpful with the tiles we have here unless we did six, seven, eight, nine. Six, seven, eight, nine. 
seven, eight, nine with eights. Okay, I think we're gonna have to give up on Dora and focus here for a, a winning potential. I don't think the, let's give up seven dot and keep the bam just to see, cause we could still do six, seven or seven, eight, seven, eight with flowers if we ever get them. Let's draw. We got a flower. I wonder if we could play five, seven, nine. Oh, you know what? Those sevens have to be pairs. These have to be pairs. We have no seven. Five, seven, nine, third hand down, Kong, pair, Kong. With a gap that is a pair, that is really, really risky. I don't know if I would do that. Let's discard three dot. We got a five crack. That's not helpful for this player. Five crack up here. We have to decide. We already let a six go. We could Kong pure and make it work for either addition or six, five, six dragon. Let's, let's commit. Let's commit to fives and see what happens. We could still maybe do north and south with fives. We have no other fives though. But if we're going to commit, we need to get rid of Dora right now. Seven bam. And nobody's ready for it. So we're going to draw. Flower. Okay, now we got a flower. Seven, eight, seven, eight. This would be a pair. There's one out. Or we could do seven, eight, nine with eights. I think at this point we can give up on the six. Six crack. Oh, you know what? Wait a minute. We're going to Kong right here. Six crack. We'll make it work. So we could play addition or dragon. So we're going to get rid of all these. So let's go ahead and discard. Let's discard South. Four crack. That's a discard. Flower. If we could even get one seven bam, we could do five seven nine with flowers. We could always maybe switch to like numbers with fives and flowers. Let's go ahead and give up on these cracks. Seven crack. It's this player's turn. This player is maybe playing concealed. We can't take it anyway. Even if we wanted to, we can't. A pung in this arrangement is not going to work. So we're going to draw. Seven dot. Six, seven, six, seven. Dragon. Let's see here. Five, six, seven, five, six, seven. There's a three bam out. Two three bams are out and two four bams are out. I think we should probably give up on the pair hand. Let's discard one bam. Eight crack. Oh, let's give up the north. Seven crack. That is a keeper for that concealed hand. 
seven, eight, nine, or we could do seven, eight, seven, eight with flowers. Let's discard nine dot. Four bam, or no, that's a four dot. Four bam, that's not a four bam. White. Okay, we have the makings of a pear hand here. Six, seven, six, seven, flower. Six, seven, six, seven, matching dragons. Let's discard four bam. I got it right that time. So we'll see what happens here. Let's just hold it. One, oh, we got the one crack. That's a pair for addition, but we have no flowers. Oh, that's painful. Oops. Let's get rid of eight crack. Down here, I think I would stay concealed and probably focus on seven, eight, nine with eights. This is a pair and these match the pair. There's a seven bam out. No eight bams are out. I would let that go. I would not take that for a pung. Because if we play seven, eight, seven, eight flowers, second hand from the bottom under consecutive run, we would commit to a pung of eights. And there's, there's no plan B for that. Really, there's one plan B, consecutive five through nine in one suit. We have no five cracks. They're up here. So I think we need to stay concealed and commit. Four crack. One dot. Okay, that's a keeper. If we play one, three, five, five, nine. Okay, well, let's see what we can do. We're going to discard nine crack. We'll stay concealed and see what happens. One, three, five, five, nine. We can use this to help with the five and one of these. Three crack. Well, let's get rid of two bam. We need flowers. We got a white dragon. That is not helpful. <laughs> We're going to discard white. Oh, Joker. That's nice. Let's get rid of nine dot. Oh my gosh, we got a five ban a five dot. Look at that. Let's get rid of a flower. And nobody can take it. Red. Five, six, six, seven, or six, seven, six, seven. These dragons. We don't need this dragon. Red. This player is not ready. East. I probably should have kept that and discarded these. We're in the middle game, but we're getting towards the end of that wall. So we should probably discard these risky tiles here, flowers and dragons. Six dot, that's not helpful, but nobody's been winning these nines. Six dot. Four bam, those have been discarded. We need flowers very badly. Nine bam. This is concealed. We could maybe pong or Kong and play five, seven, nine, but we have a gap where there's a pair needed. I would not commit to that five, seven, nine hand. That would be the third hand down under odds. One crack. Eight 
eight dot. Two dot. North. Green dragon. Nope. We need a seven bam. East. We should be getting rid of these flowers. There's a flower. Okay, now let's think about this pear hand. Six, seven, dragon, six, seven, dragon. There's a white dragon out and a green dragon out. There's a seven bam out. We don't need this three. Let's discard and see what happens. That looks pretty. It's risky though. It's risky. Five, six, dragon. Hmm. We'll see. We need flowers here. Three dot. We're committing to a hand with no flowers. That is a gap hand. West. Last tile, third wall. We're going to discard these flowers. Flower. This player probably should decide what to do. They could take that for a pung. Play five, six, dragon. Or six, seven, dragon. I think we should pung. Oh, the pear hand though. Potential pear hand. There will be more flowers. That's the first one out. Let's wait. Yeah, three bam. Okay, now that's going to be helpful. We need flowers. Let's discard white dragon. That is the second one out. This player probably should give up on that pear hand. Let's draw. North. Five dot. Oh my goodness, okay. We can put maybe that there, that there. Let's discard flower. Okay, they're one away from ready on this, this hand, this concealed hand and we might be able to use Dora. Let's draw. Nine crack. Nobody wanted the white. Let's discard. We need flowers or jokers. Three crack. Eight dot. Okay. I would commit then to this. Seven, eight, nine with eights concealed. Let's get rid of the flower. That's the third flower out. I think we should take it. Pung. We could still do six, seven dragon maybe. Let's discard nine crack. This hand is concealed. Oh, look, red. <laughs> Wow, let's get rid of green dragon. Oh my goodness, they still have no flowers. You'd think that we would draw a flower. Let's draw. Okay, we need eights or a nine. A nine crack, two nine cracks are out. We need this here. We need eights. We got the seven. Oh my goodness. Oh no. Oh, shoot. I don't think there's anything we can do here. We got the seven. I think it's too late though. They're, they're so close to this concealed hand. And with the concealed hand, you qualify for Uradora, which is the Dora tile 
under the door indicator. So let's stick with it. Let's discard Dora. Seven bam, that's the second one out. They're not ready. Oh my gosh, one. We got it. We've got it. We're ready on a seven bam. Three crack. Eight crack. This is concealed. They wouldn't want it anyway. We need eights. And here we need flowers. Oh, that'll do. Okay, now, let's see. Because we need four flowers for addition, let's play the dragon hand. Because we could pung and be ready to win on either one. One crack. Okay, we need eights. We got a five. We need a seven, bam. We got a joker. Let's, let's discard five dot and not give away that we're ready on a single or pair, five dot. Because there's no way we can play this at this late stage pure. Let's draw. Actually, I probably should have rethought that because if they're concealed, if Uradora is a four dot, then these would add value to the hand. Four dot, there are two four dots out. Two four dots are out. I probably should have discarded the Joker because they're concealed. We'll see. That might have been a mistake. Eight bam. This is concealed. Three bam. North. Two bam. Nine bam, five, six, seven, nine. Six dot, nobody wants. <gasps> Red dragon. Okay, they're ready to win on a flower. <laughs> One crack. They couldn't get flowers, but they got jokers. Let's draw. Three crack, three, six, seven. All these need to go out and this is risky, so let's discard seven bam and that would be Mahjong for this player. One, three, five, five, seven, nine. Concealed. Since they played concealed, they qualify for Ura Dora. And they have Dora. We're going to reveal Ura Dora. This is the Dora indicator. This is the Ura Dora indicator. So they qualified for Ura Dora because they're concealed. They have Dora right here. This is a 30 point hand and they have one Dora tile. So that will be a 60 point hand. 60 points paid by this player, 120 will be owed. These two players pay 60. Three of the four players tried to work in Dora. And in the end, it worked out for one of them. If you do not need Dora, discard it early before the end of the third wall. I think that's the best strategy when it comes to Dora. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, consider subscribing. Click that little gray bell if you do. That way you'll get notification for when I post new videos and you won't miss an opportunity to learn a new strategy or pick up an insight to the game that could give you an advantage at the table between now and the next solitaire for American Mahjong using National Mahjong League rules. 
with a little bit of anarchy. May all your picks be keepers. <laughs>